Hundreds of people have gathered to show their support for the pilgrimage to Burns Bog and to voice their distaste for the Gateway Project in the South Fraser Perimeter Road. Having already destroyed hundreds of acres of Canada's most fertile farmland, they are concerned the construction of the South Fraser Perimeter Road is going to damage or destroy a large section of the lungs of the Lower Mainland, a name given to the bog because of its ability to absorb tremendous amounts of carbon. Dubbed an interfaith pilgrimage, people from all walks of life attended the rally, which began on the north side of the Alex Fraser Bridge. As the protesters crested the summit of the bridge, an enormous Climate Action Now banner was unfurled on the south side of the Fraser River, on the empty lots where many houses have already been bulldozed to make way for the new container truck route. Not after the, the property, most of the bog was bought, that uh, it would be safe. But then South Fraser Perimeter Road came along and it's not safe. Uh, so we decided to start up a combination of helping people fall in love with the bog. And we figure if you fall in love with it, then you'll protect it. And that's what people are out this here today. Bog. Why do they want to develop this bog? Why, what, what's all this all really about? It's about developing the last real big available green space in the lower mainland close to Vancouver. It's about development. And what's development about? It's about making money. It's about cash. Some people are going to make a lot of money developing. When people talk about what really brought them happiness in their life, it's their communities. It's their families. It's the time they got to spend with their children or with their grandparents. Our democracy has been hijacked. It's been hijacked by money and business. And democracy is a verb. Democracy only works in action. Democracy isn't going out and casting a vote every four or five years. That's not democracy. That's just handing over your power to somebody else. Democracy is this. Democracy is when we say no. Earth is the only planet, my friends, which supports us, all the living beings here on. There is no other planet so far the scientists have found which is supporting the green energy because it works. It makes sense. It's the best solution that we have. The best way for us to live our life is to ensure that we have uh, we have agriculture that's sustainable for the next 25 years. <laughs> it's not called the lungs of the lower mainland land for nothing. I and mean, if this is a carbon sink, this recycles carbon dioxide into oxygen. We need this for all of our health. I'm, and it's also a precious archaeological site. The thing has been in the works coming along for 40 years, 20 years, 5 years, and the reasons for it have kept changing. Um, but why it's being pushed, I think it's like an empty freight train at this point. It doesn't make any sense anymore economically or in any other way. I'm feeling right now that what the government really needs to stop this is a good excuse to stop it, to back out without save and save face, because it doesn't make sense for anyone anymore. This is Elvis Glazier reporting live from Burns Bog, here for the Delta Free Press TV.